Hey everyone, in this video I wanted to show you a new feature in Edpuzzle that's called Teacher Assist, and it's going to be one that you definitely want to check out. It's going to make your life so much easier when you're adding videos to Edpuzzle and adding questions to Edpuzzle. So let's take a look. So here I'm on YouTube and I found this video about adding fractions that have different denominators uh, from Khan Academy, and I want to put that into Edpuzzle and I want to share it with my students. So first thing is I'm going to um, ensure that I have the Edpuzzle extension installed. And with that, it allows me when I'm in YouTube, it allows me to have this button down here where it says edit with Edpuzzle. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna select that. And now I have the video here and I can watch it here. I can do a voiceover, which has been there and then I can add questions. The new feature here that it's still in beta is this feature here called Teacher Assist. And what this is going to do is it's going to generate questions for you off of the video that you put in here. So I can just click on this button that says generate questions. And it's going to ask, do I want open ended questions? Do I want multiple choice or do I want both? And for this, I'm going to go ahead and select both and it added one open-ended question for me. And here I can look at the question and I can decide, do I like this question? Do I not like this question? I can edit, I can change up the wording if I want, and I can go ahead and save. And then once I'm finished with this, I'm going to go ahead and press continue. And now I have this question in there for me. I can go in, I can add other questions that I want, but I just clicked generate questions. They go ahead and it generated a question for me. I can finish. And now I can share this video with my students and they can View the video, they can answer the questions, and then I can get the feedback from them. So this was just a quick video talking about Edpuzzle Teacher Assist. It's a great way to bring videos in, have Edpuzzle use AI to generate questions for you. Then you can go back, you can refine them to fit your needs and your class's needs, and then you can move on and assign that video to your students. I hope you found this video very helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.